So just a little snippet journal entry. Um, I was just discussing with my mom about our family and what we learned growing up, what we inherited from our family members. And uh, we're talking about my dad. My dad has a good sense of responsibility. He's not lazy, it's really routine. And, and I think that's why he's so healthy now as a 78 year old man. He's, a, he's, he's a remarkably healthy and active and able physically and mentally. And that's a, a, you know, that's a great achievement, but that's what we all strive for. However, on my mom's side, she was lacking from her family. They didn't teach her a sense of responsibility and my grandmother, because she was a, a single mom and the dad wasn't around to, to teach the kids responsibility and, uh, and a sense of urgency and not to be lazy, my mom inherited those same habits. And it was hard for my mom uh, as an adult because she, the truth is, she, she never really liked her job. I don't. I don't think she did. I'm gonna. Am I right or wrong, mom? Tell me about. Tell me about that. Can you just make a couple words? Yeah, I like. I like my job as transcriber, medical transcriber. But can you address what I'm saying real quick? Just real quick, mom. What am I saying? You're saying I never really liked my job, but I said. You know what I'm saying? I, I did like my no, job. No, 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 mom. I'm saying. I'm saying that because you were lazy. It was hard for you as an adult. That's what I'm saying. Well, I, Is that true or not? I, I had a job about uh, and transcribing. Yeah, I know, mom. Mom. Sure. Okay, so my mom doesn't. She doesn't want to answer the question. That's okay. That's okay. It, it's hard for her to, to, to talk about this, this subject, no, and that's okay. No, I'm trying to. Mom, I, I, was, I was saying. My, right now, what I'm what I'm inputting into my journal is, I'm saying that because you were not taught good work ethic, it challenged you as an adult to have a job. Because, just let's just say it, you were lazy. It's, I don't want to say that. No, that sounds bad. It does sound bad, but it's the truth. I mean, okay. So okay, how about this? Do you do you disagree? Do you disagree? I worked many years. No, okay, see, my mom is saying she worked many years, so she's not answering the question. Here's the question, mom. Let's just restate it so that we have a clear response. I'm saying that you were not taught good work ethic, and because of that, it was hard for you to work as an adult. I'm not saying you didn't have a job. I'm saying it was hard for you. That's your opinion, man. No, no, it's okay. Disagree. Can you disagree? Ian, I'm an oh yeah, lazy person. Yes. That's not true, though. So you're not lazy. Okay, so look, and there you have it. That's okay. So, so there you go. So it's, my, it's okay. See, she, now we're trying to, we're almost getting into an argument because, hey, that's okay. Hey, look. So let me restate it then. My mom's not lazy. She says she's not lazy. I'll take her word for it. Okay, I'm lazy. How about that? I'm lazy. I, it's okay. That's okay, mom. See, now it's almost, these are, these are touchy matters. And it's good that my mom has that response because it shows you the sensitivity of the subject. Good. See, I'm glad it documented that, that scuffle because that shows how delicate it is. Anyways, I'm lazy. I inherited it from my mom. Even though she's not lazy, I inherited laziness and a, and a lack of responsibility, a sense of responsibility for the important things, which my dad had. But I didn't because I didn't grow up with my dad, so I inherited my mom's traits. And... Um, but, and that's, that's a dangerous characteristic to have as, a, as, adult, as an adult because it makes, you know, getting a job, it makes being responsible excruciating and also it makes you fall into ruts. And I think that's many times the case for people who get hooked on drugs, people who never are able to achieve or produce for their own selves. And I think one saving grace that I had was my determination to break free from
from who I was because I knew that I wasn't complete and I had to change myself and I think that's where I, I reached out to traveling foreign languages the open world because I knew that if I threw myself into that what I would get back in return would be a changed person and I achieved that and I think it's important for me to document this because I am fascinated with the, the, the concept of wanderlust and why people are, are, um, are, are uh, pulled, you know, compulsively determined to break free from their, their original situation and to see the world, to not get stuck in a routine. For me, I can say that a lot of that was changed. Also, you know, there's there's a, there's many other layers to it too, which I can't think of right now. But at least I can recognize one single layer, and uh, it's important for me to to keep that to to remember that.